This is my 2022 Sea-Doo Fish Pro. Kind of give you a walk around and show you what type of accessories I added to this jet ski. Uh, it's really gonna make it an ultimate fishing craft for me. Kind of walking around here, I've, uh, as you can see, I'm gonna have this with live scope. I have live scope on my other watercrafts and I really go, go after the crappie in the springtime. Of course, I'll be taking this out to the Gulf as well. Uh, I've got a 24 volt lithium battery. Mounted right here, I've got plenty of room. I'll have my, uh, uh, some of the live scope, uh, range to my live scope will be back mounted here in front of the, the 24 volt battery. But again, you can see where the live scope's gonna be at. Got this real nice railing system. Um, and I'd like to make a, a comment that I haven't really had to screw anything into my, my hole at all on trying to get these additional accessories on the craft. Uh, but we've got a sliding system, so when I'm not using uh, the live scope, I can take this mounting bracket, I can remove it from the watercraft, which I think that's kind of nice because it's still a, something we can have fun on out the lake. I can remove uh, remove all this. This is just a stabilizer bar that comes out, uh, provides a little bit, a little additional stabilization for the head of the the trolling motor, and I mounted a Minn Kota uh, Altera, so it's got the self deploying feature. I can pull this out easily, remove the uh, the trolling motor. Uh, this mounting bracket for the the trolling motor was fantastic. It's really, really solid. I had a company here in my area to do some fabrication work for us and it really came out nice. I had it all powder coated. Uh, moving around here, I've got, um, this is where my trolling motor is plugged in. I got it plugged here. I've got that, um, uh, cord running all the way back to the back of the of the uh, sea uh, for the 24 volt battery the lithium battery which the battery only weighs 25 pounds so i didn't want to put two uh, regular lead batteries back there that's pretty heavy and and provide put additional weight on the back end of the of the craft here is my garmin it's a 12 inch garmin you can see uh, the 126 uh, great unit great for live scope i've also mounted an out an exterior transducer I believe it's a T54. I'll show you where it's mounted at underneath the boat here. It's got a really, really nice mount. Um, just a perfect place there to, to mount it. Um, this whole mounting system, I got it from a company called uh, GC Jet Ski Fishing. They're a company out of the ne Netherlands. Uh, really nice, nice solid mount there. So I had to do a few, few things on, on getting that to to fit in there, but really proud of how that turned out. Um, but yeah, I'll get some pictures when I get this thing in the water. I've already taken it out once and trolling motor performed wonderfully. Um, held the spot lock just perfect. So like I said, I'll, I'll get some more footage once we get on the water with it. Really happy with it though.